Hi traders and welcome, Lockie here from Samurai Day Trading out of Singapore. Now, ladies and gents, recently I've been asked by a number of people, hey Lockie, I'm in the European Open Live Trading Room. I would like to trade or watch the FDAX as well as the NASDAQ or the S&P 500. Well, so what I'm gonna to do today in this video is actually show you exactly how to load that UREX data feed. So if you do want to uh, if you do want to actually watch the FDAX or start trading the FDAX, learning about that, or you might even wanna trade the FDXM, which is the micro contract, as you'll be able to do all of that. So as what I'm gonna do, first things first, we're going to log into your NinjaTrader. As we're gonna log into your actual NinjaTrader, call it the back office, if you will, of your, of your membership. Now guys, the very, very easy URL at the top. So basically you're just gonna to go to ninjatrader.com, you're gonna sign in. So here's my username guys for, for this particular private account we're gonna be talking about. Guys, I'm gonna put my password uh, obviously in there and then I'm going to log in to the NinjaTrader members area. Now the two-factor authentication has triggered guys and girls. So let me go and grab that two-factor authentication. For those that are not aware, as what's going to occur is Ninja is actually going to send me an email saying, hey, Lockie, are you sure you're going to be logging in to your uh, Ninja Trader? So let me go and double click on that and I'll come back to you in two seconds. All right, ladies and gents, we've gone through the authentication process. And first things first, you'll probably pick Lockie $677 as an account balance. Guys, this actual account is solely used for the data feed because all of my all of my trading is actually done through our funding partners. Massive shout out, guys, to our funding partners. They are absolutely brilliant. Now, what we're gonna do, guys and girls, to get your actual data feed up and running, you should be able to go up here to the top right-hand corner to user account and push on the little blue head. Now, when I push on that, it's gonna allow me to go to settings, all right? So when I go to settings, we're gonna bring up a brand new page. And this is what we wanna have a look at, as we wanna have a look at the plan. So you've got over the top left-hand corner here, accounts, plans, profile, preferences, and so on. We're going to go to plans. Now, effectively what this is, it's your data plan. So what are you actually, what data are you pulling in order to, in order to trade? Now, I've got a number of data plans that are already going on here at the moment, guys and girls. So let me show you exactly what to do. At this point in time, I've got the CME bundle running, which is for NASDAQ uh, and, uh, and other CME related products. Now, what we're going to do is I'm going to come down here and I'm going to go through the process of updating my subscription. All right. Now, this is for those people that want to add the FDAX or you might not have actually, guys, you might not have actually got a data feed at this point in time. So let me show you how to do all of it in one go. So I'm gonna cruise down here, guys. I'm gonna push this little button here called Customize the Data Subscription. Note, actually, while we're here, for those that want to trade, if you just wanna trade the NASDAQ and S&P 500 and the really simple indexes, guys, you can literally grab this $12 per month one as I've already done. It's called the CME Bundled Level 1 Data, guys. You don't need Level 2 Data for any of the trading, uh, the, any of the trading that we're ultimately doing. If you wanna customize your data subscription further, you click on that little button right there. And for those of you that do want to trade the Urex, what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be cruising down through via Comex, via Nymex, all the way down here, goes to this one right here. So when I click that box, when I click that box, it's now gonna show me down the bottom here, hey Lockie, you've got a subtotal of $24, would you like to proceed to the checkout? Now, when I do that, guys and girls, which we won't do because it's not required for this particular account, but if you did want the UREX data, you'd simply tick the boxes, proceed to checkout, go through the actual checkout process itself. And what you'll find then, ladies and gents, is you log into your Ninja Trader, you log into your Ninja Trader, and you will be able to find that the UREX data feed, this one we're asking for here, the UREX data feed will actually be available on your Ninja Trader via your Ninja Trader control center. Now, what that ultimately means is if you did want to trade the FTAX, you would then connect your data as we've done in the previous videos, you would connect your data and then you can load an FDAX chart. And what you'll find is the data starts moving up and down and everything works quite well. Now, a little trap, guys and girls, a little trap if I may, let me just grab, a, let me just grab an FDAX chart for you. Now, the little trap, ladies and gents, is very, very simple. Okay, very, very simple. Here is a live, here is a live FDAX chart. Okay, right here, here's the live FTAX chart. Please note we've got a large gap up. Now, the reason I mentioned that, ladies and gents, is there's no data for me in Tokyo. There's actually no data between five o'clock in the morning and literally three o'clock in the afternoon. So if you are doing that, that's Tokyo time. So if you are doing this data, guys, if you're doing this data, for example, at 10 o'clock in the morning in Australia or 10 o'clock in the morning in New Zealand, 
when you load the FDAX chart, nothing's actually going to occur until the data turns on in the European in the European morning. So for me, most currently data is turning on. It is September 2025, just to date stamp that because we've got daylight saving in Germany coming quite shortly. So my data does not turn on to three o'clock in the afternoon Tokyo time. As our trading room starts at 3.30 Tokyo time and the actual live European cash market starts at 4 p.m. Tokyo time as until the daylight saving takes over towards the end of the year. So guys, the purpose of the video is to show you effectively how to go and grab that Eurex data feed. So just as a quick revision, as we're literally going to come into our NinjaTrader, you're going to log in using your NinjaTrader username and password. You're going to come and click on the little blue head at the top. You're going to come to plans here. You're going to scroll down, select the plans that you would like to select. Guys, select the data plans you would like to select as we have already done. Guys, and particularly if you want to trade the S&P 500, NASDAQ and Eurex, you would need your level one CME data and also your Eurex data. That's going to cost you around about, say, $35 a month. So our goal would be for you to make way over $35 a day in the live trading room to justify your data feed and a lot more. So guys and girls, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope that was informative and uh, we'll see you in the live trading room as soon as you are ready to learn how to trade. Thank you and bye for now.